Nigeria na Kenya. Hii kampuni imejiriana na Kenya kuleta fanya services hapa kwetu. Sasa kuna dispute juu ya matokeo. Unaambia fungua hii sanduku, fungua sawa tuangalie kitu gani ilipo ndani yake wanakataa. Alafu mahakama inaenda kukubalena wao. Shame on them. Shame on them. Shame on them. This is not something that has been made up. This is not something that has been made up. Kwa hiyo tunasema tusipoku tusipo rekebisha haya makosa. Hakuta kuwa na haja ya watu kwenda kwa uchaguzi tena 2027. Maana yake sasa tulikuwa na chebukati tatu. Na cherera wengine nne pande hii. Sasa wanne wamekataa wamesema hii ni uongo. Jamaa wanatuambia sisi watale watatu ni wanafanya mkweli. Lakini in a democratic society you only go with the majority. The majority said no. Minority said yes. And then the Kenyans are saying we must accept the views of the minority. Hiyo ni demokrasia. Hiyo ni ukweli. This is what we are we have refused to accept. We must refuse to accept. Mane si si kwa sababu ya Raila. Raila atatoka kesho. Raila atakuwa kwa 2027. Anaweza kuwa hayuko. Lakini kama mkienda tena kwa uchaguzi na sasa itakuwa wao ambao waliiba ndio wanakaa pale umeweka tena wale waezi wenzao upande hili nyingine tumeona sasa wameenda wamebadilisha hata sheria Ruto mwenyewe nataka sasa kuteua another electoral commission yake yeye mwenyewe unafikiri hii Kenya ni ya Ruto hii Kenya inataka taka na ito Gachetha eh so this is why Kenyans must be prepared to stand up Stand up for their rights. Stand up and defend your rights. Because if you don't do that, these people will continue to rule you without your consent permanently. And we want to tell that the foreign powers, or the serikali zingine ambao wanataka kuingia mambo ya Kenya, wachini wa Kenya. Wa Kenya watasulisha shida yao wenyewe.